Hi, welcome back to the Spirit's Path. This is Dee. In Aries, your February horoscope for 2021 starts out with the Archer. And the way I like to talk about this card is uh, this is a major arcana card. And it's meant for you to keep your eyes set on the prize. Focus on the goal that you have set up. Um, you know, keep your, keep your intentions out there and, you know, aim for the target. You know, you've got the uh, bowstring drawn back and you're ready to go ahead and hit that target. You know, so just, uh, as I said, keep your eyes on the prize for this month of February. And, uh, you know, keep shooting for whatever that target may be. Whatever you set up in the month of January, and January was filled with challenges, all right, you are going to want to focus your intentions, your aspirations, you know, all towards the goal that you have in place. All right, so keep your eyes on the prize and stay focused on the target. And um, we are going to be doing something a little bit different this month, as I'm also drawing from uh, the Messenger Oracle, um, the Light Oracle, as well as the Ravens Oracle. All right, and we'll get into that. So keep your eyes to the prize. All right, and as we get into the Messenger Oracle, the Messenger Oracle wants you to nourish your, your soul. So as you're staying focused on what's out there for your intentions and for your aspirations, all right, continue to drink in the life. Continue to, you know, use your senses to, to you know, bring in new things into your life, whether that's through taste or smell or, you know, touch, you know, even your eyes, okay, your hearing. You know, open yourself up to the universe and understand you know, everything that's out there. Feel the breeze that's in the air. Feel, you know, smell the new smell that, you know, maybe it's coming from, you know, somebody's barbecue or something like that. All right. Taste, uh, you know, something different within a curry, okay, or a spice. All right. Maybe feel the rocks in, in, your, in your garden, okay, or, you know, just be able to, you know, pick out a new color, you know, within, you know, look at something like a plant and just pick out the greenness in the plant. Okay, and let that nourish your soul for the for this month. Because when you, you're able to connect with the divine, connect with the universe, all right, and experience everything that you know it is giving you, you can heighten your sensory perception. Okay, and when you do that, you can align yourself more to the goals that we talked about with the archer card. You can understand a little bit more of how that alignment is in tune with the goals and the aspirations that you that you seek. The other piece of that coming out of the Raven's Wand Oracle is commemorate. And you know, this this uh, witch is sitting there, she's you know getting ready for a festival. And uh, she, you know, there are a lot of times that we have traditional aspects within our within within our life. This month, you know, you have uh, Valentine's Day coming up, you know, commemorate that day with your loved one. Commemorate that day with a special person. And it doesn't have to be, um, you know, somebody of the opposite sex. It could be somebody of the same sex, too. All right. And, you know, Valentine's Day is for everybody. And it's, it's showing the love. It's showing the, uh, the heartfelt energy that we have for other people that's in, that's in your life. All right. And, you know, if you can nourish that energy, you know, like I said, with the nourish the soul out of the messenger or Oracle deck, you know, commemorate what you have, both the big and both the small and what's out there. And then coming out of the secret language of light, we have, you know, authentic truth. And with this card for this month, Speak your truth. Seek the truth out that will help align to those goals with that archer. Seek the truth out to help nourish your soul. Seek that truth out to help commemorate the things that are big and small in your life. Look for, you know, look for, I guess the best way to say it is just be who you're supposed to be. Be your authentic self. Because when you can be your authentic self, then you can go ahead and and speak your authentic truth. And, you know, maybe that helps you align yourself to the goals 
and intentions that you had, you know, with the archer. And maybe with that, you know, coming out of January with the challenge, now you can focus on, on those goals. You can focus on those intentions, all right? By nourishing your soul, by commemorating the little things, and speaking your truth. So there you have it, Aries. Your 2021 February horoscope. This is D for the Spirit's Path. Hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel. Leave your comments down below and share it with others. And we'll talk to you during the March horoscope. Take care, God bless, and stay safe, everybody.